हेलो गाइज असलकुम सो टुडे वी आर टेस्टिंग डेटा कॉम डी के जी थ्री टू नाइन ए टी एस कंट्रोलर सो दिस इज़ अवर ए टी एस पैनल एज यू सी सो आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू एवरी थिंग अबाउट दिस पैनल हाउ टू ऑपरेट हाउ टू टेस्ट एंड वॉट आर द इक्विपमेंट्स आर इंस्टॉल्ड हेयर वॉट इज़ द वायरिंग ईच एंड एवरी थिंग जस्ट स्टे कनेक्टेड एंड वॉच कम्प्लीट वीडियो केयरफुली सो यू विल अंडरस्टैंड समथिंग न्यू so guys before starting the video kindly subscribe our learning channel and let's get started again with our so video here we Thank have first much. of all this is called ats controller this controller will control mains power and generator power okay once mains power is always priority priority and the generator power is a standby power so now as you see mains power is available and we see line to neutral voltage is 230 volt 60 hertz is our frequency and battery voltage 12.7 okay so if we will scroll this here we will see line to line voltage which is 397 400 almost around 400 volt 60 hertz and 12.7 okay now the as you see here this here mains power is now on this indication shows mains power available and this indication shows mains power on load here this is generator power okay generator power available and generator power on load okay here we have status screen which is showing alarm warning and service request these are the three indications whenever there is a problem it will show us alarm okay here we have three indication lights jk signal jk on signal means generator is on load generator sorry generator is available this is load on signal once the load is available this is on mains power is available so this indication will be on okay this is selector switch for manually turn on the mains power this is our emergency stop okay so now if for example i will press now emergency stop so what will happen you will see it is emergency stop okay and generator will not start okay so how we will reset we reset like this okay so here if you see this is our genset contactor here we connect our testing wires okay this is our load site and we have three cts here okay this is our mains contactor okay and here we connect the mains wire okay this is our controller back side here we have if you see this gl1 gl2 gl3 and gn this is generator supply connection mains l1 mains l2 mains l3 and mains neutral and mc is the contactor command here we have battery negative battery positive relay 1 relay 2 alarm remote start emergency stop and here we have our ct connection for three ct six wire these three are our indication lamps here we have selector switch this is our emergency stop so now you see mains contactor is on as you see this is on okay mains power is on now so i will turn off now mains power and we will see the generator contactor will be on okay so now i will turn off the mains power now you listen the sound the contactor come out and the mains is waiting for generator to start and to work okay so now mains power will give command to generator and generator will start and it will give the power but now why it is not giving power because here not auto so now i press the auto mode button it is giving signal to generator fuel wait okay now the generator starting signal is gone there and generator is running now generator contactor will close you now you will listen now if you listen now you listen the generator contactor is on okay and the mains contactor is off okay so now what i will do i will return the mains power okay i will return the mains power now you see the difference the genset 2 indication light is on and mains power is failed so it's become red 
now once you will you will notice this light will become green okay once the power is on so now the genset on load okay so now i will turn on the mains power breaker here we have three breaker for mains power okay now i am turning on so now you see the green light is blinking so it means mains is available now and it is waiting for this genset on load timer okay which is now 18 second so within after 18 second first the generator contactor will off and then after the mains contactor will goes on okay so now we will see how it will work okay now you see the light is off both light is off and now generator uh, mains power will be on as you see mains power is on mains power is on okay okay so if you will check now okay it is giving alarm emergency stop so with this generator will not start okay so now everything is normal now what we will do we will check with phase failure command okay now as you see these are two three are the phases we will turn off one phase okay we turn, we turn off one phase okay so now we will see generator will on or not on we will see now it is showing warning fail to stop okay now you see generator power again on okay generator is on load now okay so this is the way now i will turn back on the mains power and see the contactor will turn on again or no now you see the mains return power is again showing and it will turn on the mains power okay now there is alarm so now you see genset on load it's returning okay <coughs> Now you see generator is off so now the mains power will on few seconds now you see mains power is on okay guys so now i hope you are very clear about ats operation so it's very easy very simple if you have any question just comment us in the below i will sure come back to you